Jocelyn, and I am a Bridge to Wellness case manager. Every year, Nationality Service Center serves 5,000 immigrants and refugees from 120 countries speaking over 75 languages. Turning 100 years next year, NSC has a long history of welcoming and empowering immigrants to thrive in our communities and pursue a just future. It is our vision that all immigrants achieve a life of safe, safety and stability, sustainable opportunities, and meaningful community connections. A connection that is universal across cultures is food. In this tumultuous and uncertain time, it has never been more important to intentionally build connections with each other. It is for that reason that we have asked you to join us at the NSC virtual table tonight. Each week of NSC Cooks Around the World, we will highlight client chefs from Indonesia, Nigeria, Brazil, Syria, and Mexico, who will demonstrate how to prepare a traditional dish. We would like to thank the Central Parkway Library for providing their kitchen space for the demonstrations and Francis Rice for donating his time to film and edit for us. We would also like to thank Reading Terminal Market for donating gift cards for the raffle. And finally, we would like to thank our amazing chefs for sharing these delicious dishes. Don't forget to take a photo of your completed dish and post it to Instagram or Facebook with the hashtag NSC Cooks Around the World to be entered in a raffle for a $25 Reading Terminal Market gift card. Also, make a donation in any amount in the next 20 minutes to be entered into a raffle for a second $25 Reading Terminal gift card. All donations will go to our We Are In This Together campaign that provides the emergency support to our clients during the pandemic, delivering culturally respectful food each week, helping clients stay housed, linking clients to health and mental health care, assisting clients with virtual learning, and getting clients back to work safely. To learn more about NSC, make a donation, or learn how you can get more involved, check out our website at www.nscphila.org. Welcome to NSC Cooks Around the World. My name is Brenda Nogales. I'm a staff member at Nationality Service Center, a nonprofit organization that has been providing services for immigrants and refugees since 1921. We are about to celebrate our 100th anniversary. And what our best, that there's no better way to celebrate than through food. And so today we have a special guest. Her name is Amina Ajako, and she's from Syria. She's gonna be preparing um, a, a traditional Syrian dish for us today. Hi Amina, how, how are, are you? you? I'm good, thank you. Thank you, thanks for you too. Thank you so much and welcome to NSC Cooks Around the World. Thank you so much. Um, can you let us know what you will be cooking for us today? Yeah, sure. You can start it? Yes. Thank you. So we have the today eggplant smoking. So we're gonna first start it and uh, make uh, baba ganoush. It's uh, same uh, mutaban. So first thing, we're gonna start it with the eggplant. So we're gonna put some eggplants yeah. in the processor. And the, are the eggs, eggplants cooked or they're just... Yes, eggs? just smoking. Okay, yeah. you just smoke them before? Yes. Okay. Yes. It will be small, but we're gonna make it two, two times. Okay. Find the you can find the eggplant smoking ready in the market. Oh, smoke, smoke eggplants already. But we're going to in, uh, smoke it in, in home because it will be fresh. Okay, so but you like to do that? Yes, yeah, sure. Whether you like to smoke at home so yeah. it's fresh. 
So now we can add the and, and yogurt. And you can find the smoke uh, at any supermarket, or do I, you have to go to a special? I think I think no, only it's Arabic market. Arabic market. Yeah, because we can't find it. It's, do you recommend any markets in Philadelphia for people to be able to yeah, get? Yeah, it? we have in the Sahari. Sahari. Sahari is big market. That okay, is. where is that located? So I think I don't know. I don't know. It's happened a different location, but we have the one only one in the right, uh, northeast. And the northeast. Yeah. Okay, that's really good to yeah. know. And now, what what are you so adding? So now here we can add yogurt. Okay. So and that's just plain yogurt. Plain yogurt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So uh, with salt. A little bit of salt. Yeah, salt here. Yeah. Um, Garlic powder. Garlic powder? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Just mix it again. Yeah. difficult time getting this off and do you need a bowl for this or do you just want yeah, to sort of yeah. nice one? yeah we need to make that one too so oh, oh okay. okay i mean that should be enough you don't have to do the whole really? thing yeah okay. it should be enough it's just to show yeah sure. you know it's not so all right so, now, so that's so we can testing for tahini Yeah, I think it will be if somebody somebody like it. It's more more uh, salt. Mm -hmm. Somebody don't like, doesn't like it's it. salt. Yeah, it depends on your preference. If you want more salt, you if can you want add more salt. You can course. add. Yeah, if you want um, more, maybe tahini, you can add more. Okay, yeah. and is tahini spicy or no? No. Okay. No, no, no it, it just gives it a, a different flavor. Yeah, okay. but I think it it will be good. Yeah. You wanna put it some in dish? You can okay. add meat inside. With oh, we have a dish if you want to. Oh, so you yeah, see yeah, yes. sure, yeah. So that way you can have a whole presentation. Yeah. Is it what is pico? Mint. Oh, mint. Yeah. And so it's dry mint. Mint. Okay. So if you have olive. Oh, olives. Yeah. Okay. It's really bad. So good with olive. Okay, that's wonderful. So that one is real, really good. Okay. So we're gonna watch, watch. 
Need more tahini, maybe four, maybe five spoons, big one. Okay, so five spoons. Yes. Of tahini. Yes. Right now we're making some hummus. Now, yeah, mix some salt. We're gonna add some salt. No, that one it's lemon spice. Oh, the lemon spice. Yes. That one we're gonna check out every couple of minutes because we don't need to add more. So yeah, we're gonna check out salt to taste. Yeah. I think it will be more spice. A little bit spoon. more? Yeah. So we're adding lemon spice in. Okay. 
Yeah, it's good. For salt, it's be good. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm gonna add one more spoon of tahini. Does tahini help with the consistency? It makes it less thick or it yes. adds? Yes, yes, exactly. For, okay. for, for spice, for cool. taste, for its, um, for tasting. For it tasting. will be. Yeah, you like it. It's almost famous with the heel. Mm -hmm. Yes, so not heel. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think it now it will be ready. ready. Yeah. What do you usually eat with that? With bread. With bread. With bread, with uh -huh. cookies, with food, uh, with any sandwich, with any veggies, any, yeah. anything. Okay. Anything. Yeah. That's really wonderful. So for my business, it will be hummus and baba ganoush. It's the best one. Okay. People so like it. Yeah. <laughs> Really if, you, if you have olive, green olive, green olive, you green just... olive and olive, it will be so good, delicious mm -hmm. with him. There it is. Do you add any other spices? Yes. Also? Yeah, we need cumin. Syrian spice. I think it's have here too. Okay. So delicious with hummus. Kim. Kim, yeah. And olive. Olive, it's, okay. Yeah. It will there be so go. delicious. So I, I will be, you like it. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. So there mm -hmm. you have it. Bama, how do you say? Bama Baba, Baba Ganoush. Baba Ganoush. Yeah, Baba Ganoush. And that one hummus. But for that one, it's, uh, you can keep in the fridge, it's okay. okay. But that one, you're going to make it. You have to make it fresh? You're going to cook it fresh. So okay. If you want to, if you want, I can, I can make that one too, because it will be good with you. That's okay. So the barbecue noose, you can put it in the refrigerator and okay, save okay. it for another time. But yeah, when the hummus, it, but you, you want to do it fresh. Yeah. Because otherwise it goes, it goes bad. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because that one in the, I buy that one in the fridge. Okay. okay. So if you open it, uh, you have to use it. Once it's open, it you, have it. you have to use it. You have to use it all. Thank you so much. This is wonderful. Thank, Thank you for you. joining us. Thank you.